What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all having a great day or night, wherever, whatever time it is, wherever it is you are. Um, thought I'd make a quick little video, uh, no update with the GTR, so I thought I'd make a quick video on my bar that I've made in my home. Uh, bar slash arcade room. Um, I actually have a game room upstairs. If you guys want to see anything about that or the layout of it, let me know in the comments down below. That's where I keep all my nerdy stuff and my consoles you know comic books but down here this is where the drinks and a little bit of arcades not completely finished still more to do but this is the progress so far so let me take you down so one of the first things i've done is actually replace these um i actually sorry the first thing i did was paint because down here this was terrible this was this was like a pink salmon color it was just terrible awful color um so i replaced the with Galaga, the little light switch cover. And then this one, I have Pac-Man. <clears throat> so this is the overall layout of my little downstairs bar. So this bar right here, this was actually, a friend was renovating one of his bars and <clears throat> he asked if I wanted it. So I picked this up for $50. Just so you're aware, everything inside here, I've done all this for about two thousand dollars roughly give or take a hundred or two um so not a bad deal picking this up for fifty dollars let me plug this in real quick so you guys can get a little bit of light so down here this is kind of where i keep all the mugs hopefully you guys can see that little cocktail mixtures and then some games and then you got your your vodkas your wines i actually had these as a gift from my parents, uh, imported from Hawaii, from Maui. Uh, I brought this back down from Chichen Itza in Mexico. You see a little scorpion on the bottom. <clears throat> so not bad. You know, this is the only thing that I need to actually get done with this, is this, when this, where this came from, it came out of the basement of someone at my friend's house, and it was in their bar, and the previous owner, the original owner of it, the carpet, that, that's what the carpet was. So he just laid it out on the bar itself too. And it, it just old design. So I'm actually gonna get rid of that, put some like wood, stain it, make it look really nice and match the rest. <clears throat> I picked up these seats right here from Target. They were about $35 per, and they're pretty sturdy, not too bad. You know, <clears throat> if you wanna, you can definitely up to get more expensive ones, better looking ones. But for $35, they're, they're really not bad. These, however, I picked these up from American Furniture Warehouse. I don't understand why furniture is so expensive because I picked up these a uh, hundred each. I, 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 don't, I don't see what's so special about this that would make it a hundred dollars. I mean, it's nice, don't get me wrong, it's very nice. But a hundred dollars each, I was expecting maybe 40. But this, Something real cheap from uh, Walmart that was only like $30. That I'm gonna get placed eventually. So come back to the bar and all these lids from the beers, I'm actually gonna put that on a table that I have uh, waiting inside my garage. That, so the, I had this idea, I had this idea to do kind of like a Greek mythology theme, right? For the bar. And I was like, I found that at Hobby Lobby and I was like, that is awesome. So I picked that up. That was maybe $15. And then go along with my little Zeus picture. Little mini fridge. So this was like, what? I think another $40, $50. There's not much in there right now. I did have people come over and pretty much drink it dry. So I gotta restock that. Over here, this is probably the more expensive parts of the bar. I picked up, these are, <coughs> excuse me, these are the one-up arcades. Very good arcades for, for budget. So don't get me wrong, if you're gonna buy a light, uh, the, the actual size arcades, they're gonna be a little bit more pricey. These yeah, I picked up for about 300 each. Now, you have, if, I'm, I'm really short, I'm 5'4", and you can see just how how high this is about cheek level 
Now it's gonna be a lot smaller if you do not go get the arcade, one-up arcade stands. That's gonna run you an extra $50. So just keep that in mind if you're gonna buy one of these. But I highly recommend them, they are amazing. It takes, <clears throat> I'm not a genius in any way, and it takes me about an hour to set it together. Real easy. This right here is gonna set you back about $100. I had to have it because, I mean, come on, if you're gonna have the Miss Pac-Man, at least get the Pac-Man stole. That was actually at Walmart as well. Um, I think they have a few other stools that you can buy. I think there's a Mortal Kombat one, but they're, just to let you know, those are gonna run you about $100. This area hasn't had anything in there yet. Uh, I just have some, a bag and some weights. I plan on, I plan on putting a poker table down here and then hanging my photography. And then behind the bar, I'm actually gonna set a TV back there. So that's all to come. Not yet done. This is just showing you what I have so far. Picked that up from Hobby Lobby as well. That was like $5. That actually was pretty cool. So I wish it just lit up. That's the only issue is it doesn't light up. I wish it did. And then right here, I picked this up from Hobby Lobby as well. Pretty awesome. It's got the little, it takes like two AA batteries and then a, a light switch underneath here. And then it comes with two extra battery or light bulbs, sorry, in case it burns out. The only issue is gonna finding those identical light bulbs. That might be the only issue you have. So keep that in mind. But it does come with like two extra light bulbs in case they do burn out. And then probably one of the coolest things down here are the light fixtures that I put in. So I know it's probably pretty hard to see on the camera from what I'm seeing on the lens that you can't really see it. So let me shut it off and then give you a good up and close view of it. So those cost me about $80 and I had, <clears throat> I had my dad help me install them. I don't like playing with anything electrical. I don't like electrical. I don't like getting shocked. But the only issue I see with these is replacing the bulb. Because up top, it doesn't really have anywhere where you can screw off and pull out the bulb. I think you can load, I picked them up from Lowe's. They should be able to tell you how to swap them out if you ever need them, but I recommend them. It brings the room together so much. I'm gonna see if I can find an old picture because uh, I didn't plan on making this video, so I didn't happen to take a picture of, or video of the room, of what it looked like before. I think I took one picture. I'll see if I can find it and put it in here for you. It started. Day one, we are building the man cave. This is gonna be the new man cave. Uh, so today, you know, I'm not gonna do whole step-by-step -step how to. This is just the transformation of uh, my man cave. Uh, the slash bar. So first thing we're gonna be doing is changing these the paint. Uh, this is kind of like a I want to say not salmon. It's it's got like a, a pinkish tint to it. So that's gotta go. Uh, so you can at least see the progress of it so far. So let me stand back and then give you an all overall good view of it. So it's not bad. This is what two grand has pretty much gotten me and that's with paint everything else stocking it the furniture the arcades and then the mini fridge and everything else so this has taken me about i've been really slow at it i should if i hustled i could have gotten it done a lot sooner but this has taken me about a year to do and this is me all by myself setting this up <clears throat> these are so fun they honestly are if you're gonna have friends over you gotta get one of these this game here has 12 different games on it so those are all the games that are on this one this is the legacy edition and then this one has four other games on there well guys that's pretty much the video I'll start updating you guys more on as I start to do more with the bar uh, i might even swap that out for a better one not sure yet it's such a good deal I, I mean there's still so much i could do with it so i'm not too sure but yeah thought i'd make this quick video 
If you guys like this video, please smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already for future content. I'm trying to put out more and more and more. I've just been swamped between work and other issues I've had in my life. <clears throat> but I promise to be posting content as much as possible. Thank you for all you for all those who have already subscribed. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.